Hey guys, it's Dee Dee back again with another wig review for you guys. And in today's video, we are doing another Bobbi Boss Lace free position wig for you guys. And it is their um, four and a half deep lace part, as you can see, along with baby hairs. And it's supposed to be their soft wave series, which, hmm, you know, doesn't look too bad. So, um... I did just do another wig on this, the same like brand, like the Soft Wave series, and I talked a little bit about that so you guys can go back and um, watch that. And I must say that this wig is better even though it's from the same series because the curls are more consistent. Like you guys, I don't know if you guys can really see because the hair is black, but it's like more bouncy. The waves, I mean the curls are more consistent, like bouncy and stuff kind of how what I talked about in the other video about how I wish that the other wig had these characteristics or whatever so this much more this is more most definitely my favorite out of these two so far I don't know if I'm going to be still doing this whole series or whatever but so far this is the best one um because of the hair consistency and everything now as far as the wig goes this is their style Sierra in the color 1b um, I don't really care for the 1B color. I have to have pops of color and everything because I just feel like black is just too much on me. So, yeah, I just rather have, like, you know, some pops of color, whether it's brown, just anything. So, yeah, it comes in um, other styles and stuff. It comes in four other different styles. And the other style that I did was the wig LOE. So make sure you guys go check that out as well. And so as far as this wig goes, there's two combs at the top and then the comb in the back. So it was nicely constructed. Um, It is big head friendly. And like I said before, it is to where you can position the wig. It's not a free part. It's a free position, which basically means you can move the wig on each side. Whether you want middle side, left side, right side, it doesn't matter. You can move it because it'll still work out. Now for me, since I did the middle part on the same soft wave series with the other video, I decided to do a side part for this one. And so I did, and it's not like a deep side part or anything. I could maybe like deepen it a little bit. I don't know. And then I just added like layers on this side so it didn't like drown out the hairstyle too, too much. The only thing about it is this is a very, very, very dense wig. So you would have to most definitely plug this wig if you want to get the most natural like look out of it. Um, of course, I didn't pluck it or anything because it takes a really, really long time. So all I did was just put it on and I didn't even glue it down. Um, all I did was put some lace tint on it and just put it on my head and it's still blending in seamlessly. seamlessly. So I do love that. They are really good with the blending of their wigs. I love Bobby Boss for that. Um, when it comes to everything else, the hair actually doesn't tangle for it to have been curled and it's really long and the, the curls are very consistent like they don't come out um or anything like that like they they keep their shape no matter how many times i've been putting my hands in it because i've been putting my hands in it way before i even came on camera and it's a very long wig i must say like the wig comes all the way down here like if i stretch it like here and so i'm five four so that's about 20 to 22 inches just pulled it's not even like straightened or anything and I do want you guys to know, like, of course, if you want to straighten it, if you don't like the, you know, the curl look, you can because it is a safe, um, heat safe styling wig. So it's up to 400 degrees that you can curl it and everything. And also it's heat safe because, you know, I use the hot comb to make sure the sides are down and everything, you know, because sometimes the wigs come out the box and they are bumpy at the top and nobody wants a bumpy wig at the top. But that also you can fix that by using a wax stick. It just works. It's just whatever works for you. But yeah, this by far is like, I really, really like this wig. I just don't like, like this side right here is very hard to like blend, I guess I should say. Like it doesn't look as natural because like I said before, it is a very dense wig, so you kind of got it. Like, you have to pluck this guy, like, for real. You have to do a lot of plucking. But I'm pretty sure, like, the end result of this wig would look amazing after you've plucked and did all the stuff that you did because the wig is just, just nice. It's just, yeah. Um, It is big head friendly. It's a very comfortable wig. Very, like, a lot of space. Bobby Boss usually does make, you know, very spacious wigs. It's very stretchy and everything. And, yeah, like, overall, I just... 
I really give this, this is about an eight, I must say. It's an eight because it does need to be plucked like a lot because it is a lot of hair and because it's black. Like if it had different colors and everything and it didn't have to be plucked like so much, then I would most definitely give it a 10. But this is an eight, but it's not bad because eight is still good in my book. But yeah, I really think you guys should um, go check this wig out. It's really, really nice if you are looking for that you know everyday type of wig or even you know when you want to pop out here and there with some long curls like you should most definitely go get this wig and i hope you guys like and comment and subscribe to our videos and make sure you turn on your post notifications so that you know whenever we post something and you can be part of our notification gang and i love you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as i enjoyed making it and i will see you guys in the next one bye